Ramadan Mubarak. Last year in 2020, we experienced like our first Ramadan via Zoom. We didn't have uh, the ability to stand behind the Imam in the Masjid. We didn't have someone else reciting Quran for us. We didn't have uh, that ability to stand side by side with each other. And especially me as a convert, uh, like I'm the only Muslim in my family. And so Ramadan became something very personal, right? Like before, you know, it's like you, you experience kind of like this, this, this wide range of ibadah. And then, you know, COVID happened and it became like this constriction. Ramadan became something very small, something very quiet, something very, uh, that happens in the darkness of the night. And subhanAllah, initially it felt like, are we ever going to have that again? Like, am I like, is this quickly going to end? And then it hit me. It struck me like this time Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is saying, it's me and you. I, this time it's about, we're not focusing on the, the jama'ah. We're focusing on that moment when it's like yom al and you're standing in front of me by yourself testifying who you really are and there's nothing right between us no imam no outside recitation it's just me and your heart and, and subhanallah as a result of that i think all of us were able uh to experience a ramadan that either resulted in us just in that deeper reflection of self and where our sincerity truly lie right or just being able to recognize how much we took our brother, brotherhood and sisterhood for granted. Either way, wherever we landed, it, whether it was between uh, yearning and gratitude, or whether it was between sincerity and sidq, that construction led to a great expansion.